Thank you, Mr. Chairman. As we continue this debate over housing finance reform, I'm keeping three very basic thoughts in mind. The first is that the current situation, as has been brought up previously, with taxpayers ba backing over 90 percent of the new mortgages is both unacceptable and untenable. We have, of course, arrived here due to a history of flawed government policies that continue to pose a direct threat to homeowners and taxpayers. The second thought is that the GSE model has got to go. But in order for that to happen, Congress and the FHFA must work to establish market guidelines that provide transparency and legal certainty for private investors. This will encourage private capital finance to finance mortgages, just as it finances virtually every other credit market in the United States. Thirdly, I believe that if we can establish those rules and guidelines, we will see private capital enter the mortgage market in a large way, moving us away from the mistakes of the past and protecting families and taxpayers in the process. With this in mind, I look forward to hearing the testimony of Mr. DeMarco. Thank you. We now welcome as